the word bhavana for meditation means to develop. I'm trying to develop good qualities in the mind. Things like alertness, mindfulness, ardency. I'm trying to create a mind that's stable. Because it's only when the mind is stable that you can look at yourself, look at your actions, learn from your actions, and develop more and more skill as you go along. The reason we're still unskillful in the way we speak or act or think is because we don't take a good look at our own actions, and that's often because we don't like what we see. And if the mind is not stable, it's going to get tipped over. It's either going to deny what, what you did, or it's going to make excuses, or it's going to fall into regret. What you've got to learn how to do is pull yourself out of those attitudes and just say, okay, this is the way things are. Have a matter-of-fact attitude to the fact that mistakes are made, but they don't have to be made again. And the fact that you can see it, it's a mistake, that's a step in the right direction to figure out what to do the next time around that that, that happens so you don't make the same mistake. One of the luxuries of being here at the monastery, you don't have that many responsibilities. And so there's plenty of time to look at your actions, both before and after, to anticipate what you plan to do and then look at what you actually did and figure out what did it actually give the results you wanted. You live out in the world outside, there's one thing after another, and you're done with one thing, and you move on to the next, move on to the next, and there's very little time to sit and reflect. And if your mind isn't stable, the few times you do stop and reflect, you don't like what you see, then you run away to something else. But here there's no place to run away. You're, you're sitting here right with yourself. So try to make your mind as stable as possible so you can look at things for what they actually are. So have a sense of being firmly established in the breath. Think of your awareness going all the way down to your fingers, all the way down to your toes. Have a low center of gravity so you're not tipped over so easily. Learn to feel secure right here. And it's in that security that you can actually learn. 